This video reviews three examples of powers or indices. Now in the first one we're asked to simplify a to the power of 4 times a to the power of 5. Now the golden rule when timesing expressions like this is to add the powers. So this just becomes a, it's got the same base, 4 plus 5 which is 9. So the answer is a to the power of 9. When we multiply, we add the powers if we've got the same base. Now in the second example, we're now dividing. This fraction means divide. And the method here is to go through each of the respective terms. And I'll deal with the E and the F terms first. Now this E down here is the same as E to the power of 1. So E to the power of 6 divided by E to the power of 1 we now subtract, so 6 take 1 is 5, so that's e to the power of 5. f to the power of 8 divided by f squared, or f to the power of 2, we do 8 take 2, which is 6. So this just becomes f to the power of 6. We then just do a normal division for the numbers. 45 divided by 5 is 9. So the answer becomes 9 e to the power of 5, f to the power of 6. And the very final question requires you to know what a power half means. And that just means square root. So this just means the square root of 9, which just equals 3. So 9 to the power of a half equals 3.